Good morning, YouTubers, friends, followers, but mainly to my subscribers who keep this channel growing. And for that, I thank you all. Well, this morning, Monday morning, Monday morning, and I'm gonna be honest, the temperature has dropped massively here. Um, I'm gonna go back and put a hat and scarf on in a minute, actually. But yeah, a beautiful place, beautiful city. Um, the architecture all over the place is absolutely stunning. I am getting emails coming in. I'm also getting a lot of companies that I've never heard of send me emails to say, we like your YouTube uh, as a creator. Can we advertise our product on your platform? I'm going to be honest, um, I'm very loyal. I've already got um, a lovely cider company and I'm happy with that. I'm not in it for the money. I don't want your products on my thing. The thing is, if I don't use your products already, then I'm not going to pretend. If I don't use your products already, I'm not going to pretend that they're great, am I? Yeah, I'm a pretty shit liar. So there we go. The answer is no. But uh, I, I am enjoying it. Just out for a quick, quick walk this morning. I love looking at all these buildings. They are absolutely stunning. There we go. There's a few stories breaking this morning, which I think is fantastic. First of all, Prince Andrew has launched an £81 million lawsuit against Virginia Cafe. £81 million. There we go. So she can't lie anymore in her books and all the rest of the stuff that she spins out. Great news for him. What else is happening? Boris Johnson has, re has actually revealed that he was told that he was going to be killed by Vladimir Putin. Hold on a minute. Let's move out the way of all the, of, of this. I thought this was a quiet cobbled street. Quiet cobble road. And it's not, is it? Yes, so as I was saying, Vladimir Putin has uh, once stated that he was going to kill Boris Johnson and it would only take one rocket strike. Wow, yeah? Bringing that up now. Well... You reap what you sow, Mr. Putin. You reap what you sow. Yes. And another good thing is this. And I have to tell you, look at that view, first of all. Look at that view of the city. Is it not wonderful? Well, listen to this here. The employers, Archetypes, are such good employers. They're so good and they look after their staff really, really well that another two senior members of Archetypes have resigned they do not want to work with them anymore i wonder why i wonder why you know considering that they don't bully and suppress and 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 treat their staff uh untowards it's quite shocking that staff members keep quitting from these wonderful people and the story this morning is also the united states in many many polls across the country and magazines and tabloids have all come to the same conclusion Get out and go back to the UK. We don't want you here. So there we go. And we over here are saying, no, 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 you keep them, keep them. Maybe we could uh, work out something. We could work something out. Maybe send them to Greenland or something out there where no one really goes. Yeah, or Alaska. Yeah. But uh, today's my last day here. I'm going to chill out, going to go around and see what is the offer. There's loads of issues happening at the minute in the UK government. You know, obviously, uh, Z Zawawi, the guy who tried to uh, <laughs> tax evasion, let's call it, not avoidance. Avoidance is okay. Tax evasion is illegal, which some of my members keep telling me in emails. Trevor, tax avoidance is legal. It's tax evasion, which is against the law. Well, there we go. I just want to show you that a lot of members of parliament are doing the same thing and they're not saying anything. The only time they speak out is when someone actually gets caught in out and open. Then they all go, oh, what he did was shocking. But they're all up to it. They're all up to it. And both sides, both sides. Look at this. Look at this. Amazing, isn't it? I love the buildings here. They are absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Yes. Well, last night I went to the little restaurant, chilled out. Today I'm going to head to the castle. I'm going to, I'm going to head down the hill in the middle of the castle. But the thing is, you've got the castle steps, which are just here. The castle steps are here, and they go right to the bottom. And there's about a thousand of them. And I tell you now, by the time you get to the bottom of the hill, you need a massage. But then your body relaxes. And then by the time you get to the top again, you're completely wrecked. There should be a lift. Well, there is. It's called a taxi. But the... Yeah, but I'm going to enjoy it. I'm going to enjoy the what's left of Prague today and then head to the airport later on and head back to the United Kingdom. I'm going to be honest with you. Um, 
I love this city, it's quite nice. Beautiful actually, really nice. People are friendly. Yeah, but it did. Did witness a child napping yesterday, so uh, yeah. My mother happened to say to me last night, Trevor, keep an eye on Gwen. You know, there's a lot of kidnapping. And me with my wit and my thinking, straight away, I de debunked her straight away. I said, listen, no one will be able to lift her and run with her. She's not going to get kidnapped. <laughs> Sounds awful, doesn't it? Yeah. But there's loads of stuff going on at the minute, people. So, uh, you know, and I love giving uh, YouTube channels a shout out. I really do. There's a lot of great YouTube channels out there. The one that I'm going to give a shout out right now to is one that I used to do. I used to do a Friday night live with them. Haven't done it in a while due to the fact that I was being, I was being attacked nonstop for a certain uh, period of time. And I didn't want anyone to be associated with my YouTube channel. I didn't want to take down anyone else. A lot of YouTube channels got restrictions. Um, yeah, tea and therapy and M's. So tea and therapy, she is a qualified therapist, contrary to what other trolls say, but uh, she does good stuff. And uh, if you haven't subscribed to her, why not, guys? You know, it's free. But thank you for your support. It means a lot, guys. Uh, the wheels are coming off the Monte, the Monte Shit Show duo, and things are starting to come together, so I'm really, really pleased. Yes, I've only got... Um, I've only got seven days to wait to see if I get my restrictions lifted on this wonderful platform. Listen, people, have a great day, but most of all, stay safe.